And they will first just with Emmett's performance, how big was it for to come up to this level and kind of see that? It was a uh, special moment. Uh, you know, he'll remember forever. He had a, a, a big group supporting him tonight as far as family, friends, and he delivered. I mean, it was it was fun to watch. Um, very, very uh, excited for him, and uh, we made some nice plays behind him. But uh, you could see the adrenaline, the emotion. Uh, he's still celebrating with family right now, and uh, I wish we could have ended it with a win. Got him his first major league win, but man. Tremendous performance. Does this give him a little bit more runway to kind of look to whether it's one more start, two more starts, to just help him kind of keeping him here? Yeah, yeah, he'll, he'll make his next start. Uh, we'll probably give him a little extra time, but uh, yeah, he'll make his next start. Obviously, a lot of very different circumstances. Do you get any flashbacks to Ross Rivers that you understand? No, no, no. It's, uh, I mean, it was a pretty easy decision. I think, you know, I was you know, actually contemplating after five innings. Um, would that be enough for him, uh, you know, given his usage that he's always ever had? Um, but kind of where the state of the pen has been as far as uses, I was trying to squeeze another inning. And so uh, to get him through the sixth inning, I thought was huge. And he might have had a handful more pitches. And, and I just felt that that was, he wasn't going to finish the game. So um, as, a, uh, as a fan, you kind of hope for that. But that wasn't going to happen in any universe. So now you're looking at, um, he had, he's never been in the seventh inning, all this adrenaline and stuff, and we're trying to build him up for the rest of the season. So it was a pretty easy decision for me. Um, and unfortunately, we just couldn't close it out. You summed up, was it kind of putting together those last couple lines of how shorthanded the bullpen was? You know, I, I liked the guys that we had. I, I really did. I, I thought that, yeah, there were, there were a few guys that were down tonight, but because Emmett went six innings, I felt we had the right guys uh, to, to finish the game. You guys were kind of talking about last night about sort of having back weight and sort of chance to sort of build a bit from the third round of the last couple weeks ago. How frustrating is this for the back the next night? It's, it's tough. Um, you know, it's, uh, it, it's a grind right now. I'm trying to sustain some, some wins, um, but uh, we're not going to quit. We're going to keep going. And um, I think certainly with uh, what Emmett did tonight, I thought uh, was the highlight of the night. And um, you know, you got to give the Giants credit; they fought back. But uh, you know, this 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 one's it, it, it never feels good to me. How about David? Yeah, David uh, kind of has a slight. Uh, it's a hamstring, upper hamstring, lower glute. Uh, situation so he'll be down tomorrow he wasn't going to play anyway because uh, Wood's going to go tomorrow uh, we'll see how he is tomorrow comes in and CT is the outside of his knee he is running down the line so uh, he's going to get a scan tomorrow and uh, we'll see how he comes in but he won't be in there tomorrow. When did Chris feel, feel he felt when he was running down the line I just saw him when he, when he hit the bag or something he just didn't look right when he was running back in the dugout, and uh, that's what it was. And you know, for CT to say he can't go is pretty telling. Is no for any testing for him, or uh, no testing for Pearl. It kind of felt like a guessing game right now with the relievers outside of Evans, just trying to figure out which guys. Talked about trying to figure out which guys you can count on late in games right now, and given different opportunities to guys and seeing. I'm going to keep running them out there. Um, I think today was a pretty easy decision given. Shelby, Phillips, and then uh, there was another guy down too. Uh, Yen Yenc down. So we had, uh, so given those three guys are down, I, I thought that, you know, we had, again, the guys that we had. So um, I'm going to keep uh, believing in them and uh, expect uh, good results to happen. You were saying he was going on his own tonight? Yeah, he went on his own, and, and I thought it was a good baseball player. I really did. Get to third base with less than two outs. Um, I don't want to play the game of because he was thrown out that it's a bad play. I thought it was a smart play, it just didn't work out. Where did you see the confusion was on that play in the 11th? So the 11th, I, I thought uh, I didn't look at the, the replay, but I think that Mookie assumed that Dino was going to send Bushy and then he put his head down, and so that's what happened. So 
And I know Luki knows that. You know, when you're the trail runner, you got to keep your head up. Do you expect to call it over the river? Yeah, we'll, we're going to make a move tomorrow. I don't know exactly who it is, but uh, yeah, there'll be another reliever tomorrow. Who do you think you're going to get the extra day before his next start? Are you fishing against the Astros? Potentially. 